So we are here with Michael Downing, who is the assistant director and animatic editor for the project at the 1130. Michael, how are you doing? Good, thanks for having me. It's good to see you. Yeah, it's good to see you too. So I have a few questions for you. Yeah, I'm, right. I'm excited to be here. Send them. Awesome. So uh, who or what are your artistic inspirations and why? Man, it's easier for me to answer now because I became a fan of shows or a fan of a movie. But um, the more I dwelled on a story that I wanted to tell and the more I worked on art to tell it, um, that's when I got more acquainted with the who. And uh, when I saw Kipo, I really want to find out who Rad Seacrest was because uh, I just really like the art style in terms of uh, like the visual clarity and the level of uh, detail and design. And I thought, man, what a great target for me to try to reach so I can tell my story at that level. And when I found out he was doing drawing classes, um, that's, uh, that's how I began and come to meet nice guys like you and work on, work on some cool stuff. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I mean, I think like Rad has just been like really rad. I mean, like to like set up his own school and to have like this interaction where like, you know, we met on the project because of his school. So I think that was like really great. Mm -hmm. And, uh, um, yeah. yeah, I hope uh, I hope we're making the community proud because it really has been something special, especially mm -hmm. when um, I wasn't sure if like working in the industry was right for me um, with what I want to do or with the time of my life. So it's been like really encouraging to see people empowered to tell their story. And, uh, you know, we met in Ethan Becker's class where we were definitely getting tools to tell our story. Yeah, yeah. That, that was very impactful. Mm -hmm. um, so I wanted to know, like, what excited you most about this project and what did you learn from the project or what skills got reinforced? Um, two things definitely come to mind because I had been working on a lot of stuff by myself. And mm -hmm. so I'm able to produce and press play on what I've made myself. So I was really drawn to the idea of collaborating at different um, levels in the pipeline and just making something greater than some of its parts, you know? And um, when we got together and we talked about, um, you know, our aptitudes and what we like to contribute and found out we had a pretty well-rounded team of, you know, character design, background design. We had storyboarders. Um, it, was, it was really cool. So I was really attracted to the idea. I was like, yeah, I want to press play on something that's way better than I could just make all by myself. And uh, <laughs> that's what happened. And uh, what was weird about it is... Uh, um, well, in Animation Fundamentals, uh, Rad, uh, he made a suggestion, you know, you got to try a few things before you find your thing. And sometimes it's not what you think it's going to be. Mm -hmm. And in Ethan's class, you know, I kind of uh, started to really like editing. Like he said, like, that's where the magic happens, baby. So, mm -hmm. you know, it was, it was really cool to like uh, think about recomping and think about the kind of revisions that a director might make. So I was, I was really humbled and honored when you asked me to take a look at the boards and see if we could cut, add, revise some stuff so we can uh, hand it over solid to our team. Yeah, I like definitely feel like so much of the process is like editing, like, cause once you get the final edit in, then mm -hmm. you can just like finish up the pro. Like, you know, it's just getting to that final step, which, you know, the final step is hard, but a lot of the work, like a lot of what's gonna, the foundations that mm -hmm. happens in the edit. So I thought I, that was really cool. I think you're right. And it was really important to me hand it to the team as well as we could get it because mm -hmm. uh, it's probably one of my own weaknesses where I'm in the middle of a project that's just ruling because I didn't nail it as early as I could. And so I find myself, um, you know, kind of overcompensating for not just taking the time on a good quality board. And uh, yeah. I really got to thank Issa and Jocks too. Oh man, how, how awesome was it be to have like second opinions say, oh yeah, 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 great idea. Or like, well, what about this? Oh yeah, I really do like that. So mm -hmm. it, was, it was really cool how well we gelled on it. And uh, yeah, it was really fun. Um, one of the skills I took away out of it is getting a little more out of my programs, working in Clip Studio. There's some batch batch commands where um, you can move some stuff around on the timeline and then reorder it in the order it appears. So when I sent you back an animatic edit, um, you could say, okay, well, let's take a look at frame 40 or so on. And so being able to share those projects back and forth and be able to speak the same language when we're talking about shots, like that was, that was, that was cool. And that's something that I do on my own, you know? 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, that like, it was really cool to communicate certain things. And then like, I think like, there were times where there was like miscommunication, but like, ultimately, like, it all came together. So that's like, it's great. Yeah, I I'm glad we ping ponged enough to feel like we all like gelled on an animatic. Mm -hmm. cool. Yeah, it was great. Well, and to be honest, uh, you gave us a lot of great stuff to start with. You know, we, oh. we, we had little to edit because you made a great board, man. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, honestly, like the the edits that come into mind was like when she like walks in the store, like that was a huge moment. And like in my original boards, like I didn't really make a big deal out of it. I just kind of like had her walk in, which like, you know, I just kind of it was like an initial draft. But like when you guys had that idea and like when you guys put that together that was the big thing for me to be like oh wow like this is really cool or like this is like this is something really special and like there were definitely like certain things I didn't even think of like and I saw the boards and I was like oh wow this is way more concise or this framing is a little bit better than what I originally had so, yeah, uh, was, yeah. yeah four heads are better than one <laughs> I know yeah I mean, like, so I honestly, like, sometimes it gets crowded, but, like, it was worth it, because, like, you get these ideas, like, you get certain things you didn't think of, like, are there, then, you know. I think you really helped us out um, by helping us establish our roles, so we could make our contribution, it was role-specific, so it didn't get too confusing, and then, you know, having, like, a creative lead like you to bump or dump stuff was cool. Um, I think the joy of it was that we gelled as a team so well that we were all kind of reaching for the same thing. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I really have to thank you because like, I, it's very, like, I'm very honored to have your respect, you know, especially because like, I'm just like 19, you know, and you're like, you're like a father, you know, like, <laughs> it's like, <laughs> and it's like, for you to still equally respect me for you to like, listen out to my ideas, like, that's like, super meaningful to me because it's like it shows like oh like I have this value or I have this thing that I'm able to show and I'm, I'm just super grateful for that and I think like it really is like a perfect team in many ways because it's like we we didn't really have like any conflicts with each other and I'm just I'm grateful for that you know um that <laughs> sorry I just I have like a weird I don't want to jinx anything so <laughs> um but the idea is that we all like gelled together. We all put this thing together and I'm grateful yeah. for that. Yeah. Well, respect as much as Eric, man, because, you know, in age, maybe, maybe there's a, th a 30, 20 kind of difference, but in art, like, you know, I'm looking up to you, bro. <laughs> oh, thanks. No, I mean, honestly, like, I think a lot of it too is like with my, like with Indian culture and stuff, it's everything's age really like. Oh uh, yeah. And it's like, there, there, a lot of it is like, even if you have something important to say, it's like the older person is the one that has all the wisdom. So it's like, um, so I, I think it's both very interesting. Like it is very good to respect older people. Uh, but then again, it's like, it's so nice to have older people respect your voice and your opinions. I'm seeing a circle more around as I get more acquainted with the art scene where um you know conventions are being defied and and i think it's a kind of cool a cool happening springing from the class environment that we're in where um you can you can tell your story and you can be the lead and you don't have to constantly to defer to somebody so like i'm, I'm glad that you're empowered to be the author of your own story and that um we as collaborators we're learning and growing with you working on it and uh you know, it's your baby. I'm proud of you. Um, but I, I think I'm as proud, as close as proud as uh, you as I can be, you know, when we press play on that thing. Thank you. Well, I, I'm very proud of you too. You you really pulled it together with the editing and uh, the directing, you know, it was, it was just great. And I think one thing I would really love to know is what are your plans for the future? And this is your time now to uh, if you'd like to plug your social media, if you'd like to share anything, you're speaking to the audience, this is your spotlight moment. So. Sure. Uh, well, man, thanks. It's a good question because it really helps me clarify my own goals, you know. Um, but I've been dwelling on a story for a while, long enough to commit to making it and then realizing just how big of a commitment that can be when it comes to 
bridge in the gap so you can tell the story at your level that you want to see it at. So I'll probably keep taking classes, keep working on my story. And um, the classes have really empowered me and uh, really helped me see where I was doing things right. It really helped me see where I could do things differently. And um, the kind of excitement that I get from applying something that we learned, knowing that it just unlocked a lot of potential and just got me that much closer to getting a project across the finish line. That has been great. And just uh, being a part of the community has been great. So on that note, <laughs> my IG is uh, R-E-S underscore N-D-E-V or resin dev because, you know, I like to research and develop art. Um, you well, know, that's the first time I heard. Yeah, that's the first time I heard what the meaning was. That's that's super cool. I'm really new to Instagram, but I'm finding out that it's a really common way for us to kind of get together and see what's going on and tap into other people's styles and uh so yeah, feel free to check it out. I got an animation on there, more to come. And uh, I'll uh, I'll put the link in the bio. So <laughs> well, I'm really not savvy with it, so I'm just kind of like humbly joining the community and uh, considering myself more a part of it now. Awesome. So you have, you know, your animation projects you're working on, and you have your social media. That's great. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. Um, and I'm just as interested in hearing what you got going on and just as interested in uh, teaming up again because uh, we've got a good squad together, a lot of potential. Yeah, for sure. Um, I think it's going to be interesting uh, to see what the future holds. But mm -hmm. uh, right now it's, you know, it's the time to celebrate and, uh, you know, good job. You know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So. Wait, how do I end this? <laughs> Anything else you'd like to add or? Um, you know, shout out to Rad How To School. Shout mm -hmm. out to, you know, our teachers, our, our Ethans, our Rads, everybody else taking classes. I'm, I'm taking another class right now, so I hope to see people around school, you know, and I'm sure we'll be catching up in Discord with our, with our friends from class. So, uh, yeah, just, just shout out to everybody who made this possible and uh, look forward to seeing more. All right. Well, it was great to talk to you, Michael. And uh, thank you so much for having this be a thing um, and uh, working with me on this project. I'm very grateful for that. I deserve it, man. Congrats. All right, take All good right. care. Take care.